action. What's good? What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Hollywood Sports. What's good, everybody? What's good, everybody? If you are new to my channel, thank you for clicking on my video and welcome to Hollywood Sports. Guys, we are here to talk about a hat count. A hat count. If you're not familiar with the hat count, guys, I'm going to explain it to you. We're talking about a hat count between Madden 22 and Madden 23. Let's get into it, guys. Let's get into it. Let me pick a play, man. Let's go. Uh, let's go to the app formation. I'm going to explain some things to you guys. Let's go with the inside zone week. And on defense, we're going to go random defense. Okay, guys, when I say hat count, we're going to count the hats on the defensive side of the football. Okay, let's look at this side. Look at this right here. You see the green side. First of all, you never count the center unless somebody's lined up over the center. Okay, if they're not lined up over the center, the center is, is a zero count. You don't count the center. Okay, so we look at the left side is green. You got three guys in the box right there. Okay, so we also have uh three blockers okay now you might say where's your third blocker at? it's the fullback the fullback will be the third blocker on this play so you're more successful running to the green side if we look to the red side we got one two three four five guys in the box versus three blockers okay you can't count the center he's in the middle he's a zero so if you count the left guard, I mean the right guard, the right tackle, and the tight end, you got three blockers right there. Okay? But let's say we reversed it, we reverse it and want to run this way, guess what? It ain't gonna let us run this way. Okay? Because how many guys do we have in the box? One, two, three, four, five. Okay? You got the defensive tackle, you got the linebacker up in the up in the box right there. You got the uh, uh, you got the uh, uh, I guess it would be their, their left end, and then you have the, the linebacker right there on the edge. So you have five blockers, but we only have four blockers. We got the fullback and the, and the three linemen. So it's a mismatch, okay? Now, what I want to say is in Madden 23, and here in Madden 22, sometimes you can disregard the boxes and the hat count, and you still can be successful running the ball. And Madden 23, if you go against that concept and try to run in the red with the defense AI improvement, the way the defensive plays, you will not be successful. Okay? Now, let's look at this again. Both sides are red, right? Okay? Let's say we switch it back to the left. Now we got the green again. Okay? Only reason we got the green because of the fullback. Okay? We got three on three. So it's a go. Give you guys a little tip, don't hit turbo. Don't hit turbo till you get to the open field, baby. Okay, now we got the we got the defense on random. Let's see what we got now. Okay, it's saying we, we can run to the left side right there. Okay. How many do we have in the box? We got two in the box. And we got two linemen. We're gonna have an advantage because all we also got the fullback coming in there, which he's probably gonna grab the linebacker. Now that Mike linebacker in the center, whenever a linebacker is right in the center. He is also a zero. You can't count him in the box. So right now you have the left end, I mean you have the right end and the right outside linebacker in the box. Okay, how many linemen do we have? We have the left guard and we have the left tackle to match up with those two. But we also have the fullback going through there so we have an advantage running to the left. Now, this is real key in Madden 23. You have to pay attention to that guys. Now let's go, let's say we point to the right side. Now it's green. Why is it green now? Because now we add the fullback to the situation. How many guys do we have in the box? We have the corner back there. No, we have the linebacker back there. We have the uh, uh, we have the left outside linebacker, and we have that left end on the defensive side of the football. So that's three guys in the box. How many linemen do we have? We have the left guard. We have the right. I mean the right guard, the right tackle, and the tight end plus the fullback. So we have four on three. Now we should be successful. Okay, we go back to the left side. We're successful either way, guys. So this is a great, great play based on the defense. Now, one thing I want to say is that I meant to preface with, 
Just because you have the green, it doesn't mean it's going to be an automatic success play. It's still based on the ratings. It's still based on the talent on the defense versus the offense. But your advantages are with you if you run to the green side versus the red side. You got to count the hats, okay? Now, Madden 23 is really going to matter. Sometime in Madden 22, you can go, you can run through the red and still be successful. You can have more uh, defenders versus blockers and still be successful because the AI in Madden 22 wasn't that good, especially defensively, okay? Let's look at it again. We look at the left side. We don't count the center, remember? So we have the left guard, left tackle. We got two blockers plus the fullback, so that's three. How many guys do we have in the box over there? We got three in the box, right? That's why it's green. Okay, we look at the left, look at the right side. How many guys are in the box? We got four guys in the box, okay? How many blockers do we have? Okay, we got three linemen, but if we switch it, we're also going to have the fullback, so it should turn green. Let's look at it. There we go, because we got four on four. We got four, we got we can we got four blockers versus four defenders. And that leaves more room for the halfback, blocking for the halfback. Okay. Even though the line, even though the line play in Madden needs a lot of work, needs to be redone, they do block better because of the AI, because of the game sense feel of gameplay system. The feel sense gameplay system helps the, the blocking. The AI is a lot better on uh, with the blocking, so the offensive line does block better. Now let's see what they're giving us right now. Okay, how many guys do we have in the box? We have three in the box. How many blockers do we have? We have the uh, left guard, left tackle, plus the, six, plus the fullback. So we have three on three. Okay? But if we don't use the fullback, and let's say we try to run to the right, how many do we have in the box? We have four guys in the box versus three blockers. Minus the fullback. If we didn't have a fullback, let's say you had a single back. Let's say you had a single back, and you had the same defense. You would not run to the right side because you wouldn't have that fullback. You'd be out man. You have four against three. Okay? Remember, you don't count the center. Okay? So we run to the left side right there. Now, uh, they're not giving me the situation that I want to show you guys something else. Okay, let's say. Yeah, let's see if we can let's see if it gives us two this time. Okay, we got green on both sides. Okay. So you can run to either side. It probably depends on the ratings of the players. Maybe you got some X-Factor players on one side versus the other side. We may give you an advantage also. Now, here, here, this is what I wanted right here. Both sides are red, okay? You got, you got on the left side, you got three guys in the box. Okay, but, but in Madden, they don't count the fullback. But you can count the fullback. But in Madden, it's red when you look at the mics in the box, okay? You got now you got a you got a defensive tackle over the center right there. You don't count him. He's a zero. He's in the middle. This the center is a zero. So you count the three guys in the box. The Mike, the uh, uh, right in and the right outside linebacker. Now in Madden, they're only counting our left guard and our left tackle. They're saying we out man. We only got two blockers versus three in the box. But our fullback's gonna go through there, so which counts for three on three. But if you do run into a situation where both sides are red, that's when it's best time to call an audible. Because your run play won't be successful or there's a blitz call. There is a blitz call. Those linebackers are blitzing. Somebody's usually, sometimes when both sides are red, there's a blitz call. I mean, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Not a blitz call. But, well, they don't know what you're running, so they could be calling a blitz. Okay. Those are the situations when you have both sides red, but you want an audible when you see both sides red right there, okay? Maybe you can order to a wide receiver screen. Maybe you can uh, uh, audible to a toss play, maybe. Maybe you can audible to a screen play, but you gotta run an audible when you see two sides on the red. But we gotta, we, really the left side is green because of the fullback. Let's point it to, let's switch it to the right side. If we try to run to the right side, we got how many in the box on the defensive side? We got four in the box. But we really have a green on the right side because we add the four back to our three linemen. We have four on four. So we should be still still be successful. Now the point I want to make in this video, guys, and Madden 23, 
it's critical you pay attention to the, the hat count, okay? You gotta pay attention to the hat count when you're trying to run the football. Even on pass plays, because if it's more in one box on the other side, somebody's left to come in for the blitz. Okay, on the pass play. All right, now I wanna show you guys one more thing. Let's go to a single back. Let me change the play. We're gonna go to a single back now. In my customized playbook, I don't really have anything up the middle, but we're gonna see. I don't think I do. Let's go to single back. All right, let's see what we have here. In my single back playbook, our runs are to the outside. Yeah. I can't see. Okay, yeah, they run to the outside. So let's do that. Let's run this uh, half back stretch. Okay, then we're going to run random defense. Now let's look at it. We can't run to the right. How many are in the box? You got one, two, three, four in the box versus our three linemen. Well, because Bates, the tight end, he may go out for, well, he's supposed to be blocking. So it's really four on four, guys. You got the linebacker, the defensive tackle, and I mean, yeah, defensive, the left end, the left end and the left outside linebacker, and that that uh, corner right there with nobody to block. So you got one, two, three, four versus one, two, three. And Bates will make four. We look to the left side. Let's say we switch it to the left side. How many in the box? You got three in the box versus one, two, three. Only only two blockers. Our left left guard and left tackles are the only blockers we have. You can't count the center, guys. Because that D tackle lined up over the center also, you can't count him. Okay, he's a zero. Whenever they're in the center, they're zeros. So we have three versus two. We definitely can't run to the left side. So we want to run to the right side because let's hope the tight end picks up the fourth guy. Now let me show you guys one more thing and I'm done with this video. Let me show you, let's do a replay. Watch the corner for Green Bay. You would think he would attack the run, right? Watch this. What did he do? What does he do? He drops back. Hold on a sec. Let me bring the box up. This guy right here, you would think he would come up on the run play, right? This is Madden 22 now. Guess what? Look what he does. When the ball is snapped, what does he do? His first movement is to run backwards. Why? It's a run play. They don't do that in Madden 23. They don't do that in Madden 23. Okay? You would think 87 Bates would be ready to block him, but he, he's not even there. He ran backwards on a run play. <laughs> Now he wants to react and come up. See? They don't do that in Madden 23. They don't come after your butt. You run that edge. But really, uh, there, the, the count wasn't good on the edge either. All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you understood what I mean by hat count. And Madden 22 sometime, it really doesn't matter because of the AI, the defensive AI. But in Madden 23, it does matter. You really have to make your head count. You know, you got to know when they're audible, when you don't have any advantages versus defenders versus block blockers, okay? I'm Hollywood Sports. Thanks for watching, and I will see you guys on my next video.